What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu walkthrough. Okay, so we finally made it to the Pokemon League, and now it is time to challenge them. Now, off-screen, I did teach some of my Pokemon some brand new moves, and I just realized something, yeah. We can always teach them their new moves, like the moves every single time. We won't fail in this one. It's been made for us to not fail and all that stuff. So let's go ahead and start talking to some people. Everyone calls me Meta Memorial. I know every move that Pokemon learns as it grows, you see. I can also help your Pokemon remember any of those moves that it has let go in the past. I'll help your Pokemon uh, recover one of them lost moves in exchange for hard scales if you have any. I do have three of those and, well, let's see. Let's go ahead and take a look at our Pokemon right here. Let's see. It has some pretty good Pokemon moves, but these are just some moves that I just don't like. Let's see. Let's see. Who... Who... Who else? Okay, let's see what Sand Slash can do. I sure... Yeah. These Pokemon... Yeah, some of these moves are, like, useless moves and all that stuff, so I'm not going to teach him that. Uh, talks to this guy. I can't be... I can't even beat the uh, first member of the Elite Four. So this is the Pokemon League, the most skilled, uh, the most skilled trainers. Wow! And then this one right here. If you go on ahead, you'll face the Elite Four one by one. If you win, one door opens to the next trainer. Good luck. I will have good luck. And then uh, let's see. Talk to this guy. Hey you! If you have an Executor, I'll trade my Executor for it. I'm very proud of my Executor. What'd you think? Sure. I think I have an Executor on me. Yes. A level 44 Executor, I'm going to be trading for an Alolan one right here. So we're going to do everything right here. Let's go ahead and get this Alolan uh, Executor. Look at this. Say goodbye to my Cantonian one. By the way, how did I get that? I sort of kind of evolved it off screen. Kind of wanted to fill up my Pokedex and all that stuff. And here it is, an Alolan... Yeah, Alolan Executor. And it is a Dragon-type Pokemon, if you guys don't know about that. Look at that. Grass and Dragon. And this guy right here is like, This is exe this is Executory is amazing, right? In a faraway Alola region, they grow up carefree, so they get really tall. Huh. Let's go ahead and take a look at this Alolan, uh, this Alolan Pokemon right here. If you guys haven't noticed, I spent most of my money trying to buy some new items right here. And we're in the... Blaze is, is Executor. Where are you? Where are you, Executor? Where are you? Yeah, and then I, I sent my, most of my Pokemon away. Actually, there you are. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at this Pokemon right here. As you can see, Alolan Executor, level 46, both Dragon and Grass type. This guy right here does have some of the similar moves that you may have on a regular Executor, but now you can actually teach it uh, Dragon-type moves. The other thing, too, its stats are pretty good. So, yeah, and it's freaking tall. 33 feet, 935 pounds of pure muscle right there. Okay. So, enough about that. Let's see. Is there anything else that we need to do? Like, talk to this individual. Are you done with your shopping? Is your party all healed up? This is a big challenge, so you want to make sure you're fully prepared. Oh, I'm prepared. I'm fully prepared. Alrighty, guys. So, yeah, we've been waiting a long time for this. My Pokemon are ready, and you know what? I do have one more thing that I kind of want to do. Let's see. We have eight rare candies. Better not waste them all since, you know, since my traded Pokemon have grown easily, we're going to just give them to my regular Pokemon right here. Let's see, it's fair to just give him, uh, there we go, 63, there we go, level 63, let's get him to level 63 right here, one more, there we go, ah, look at that, we have enough for 64, okay, so give that to Leonardo, give that to Mew de Uno, and one more to smash right here. So now we have a pretty good team assembled. And the funny thing is that we can switch out our Pokemon anytime we want. I mean, I do have a pretty great team. And you know what? Let's go ahead and give these Pikachu candies to my Pikachu. Look at that. Yeah, we're just going to give them uh, as many as possible. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, yeah. We're feeding this guy. 
We're getting ready. Now, I could have done this off screen, but eh, I kind of wanted to show you guys that, you know what, I'm not screwing around right here. Alright, one more, and there you go. And then, let's see, do I have any specialized candy for anybody else? Nope. Let's see. Nope, we're, we're good to go. And let's see. There's one more thing right here, too. We do have another team on standby at the same level, too. It won't be an issue just to go uh, go up against any other Pokemon trainer right here. We're, yeah, we're working with two teams, so it's no big issue. We can defeat the Elite Four the way they are, and, well, it's time, guys. It is time. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Walking into it like a pimp. And would you look at that. Our girlfriend from a few episodes ago is here. What's up, baby? I missed you. It's been a while. Welcome to the Pokemon League. Oh, it looks like you finally made it uh, made your way here. It sure look it sure took you a while though. Well then, allow me to reintroduce myself. I am Lorelei of the Elite Four. No one can best me when it comes to the icy Pokemon. I'm sorry, I'm getting lost in her eyes. She's got like mmm, looking like mmm. Mm -mm -mm. Anywho, freezing moves are powerful. Your Pokemon will be at my mercy when they are frozen solid. That's because frozen Pokemon can't do a thing in battle. I love it when she smiles. <laughs> Are you ready? Always, baby. Always. Mmm. Good God. She looks fine as hell. I'm sorry. So here it is, guys. Our first Elite Four battle against Lorelei. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Looking like a... Uh... Oh, I'm sorry. I'm just paying attention to her right now. <laughs> oh, my God. Look at her. She is like... She's looking fantastic and all that stuff, and yeah, yeah, Thunderbolt, Thunder, Thunder, go ahead, Thunder. I'm not even paying attention to the battle, I'm just battling these guys. <laughs> and look at that, we wreck Dugong. Yeah, buddy, okay. And then, let's see, she's about to send out Jinx, I got a good Pokemon for that. Let's go, let's see. Let's go with Mew de Uno. Mainly because we got some pretty good moves on him. Alright, Pikachu, get your butt over here. Let's go with Mew de Uno. That's right. Psychic versus Psychic, but I got a little bit of a curveball for you right here. Let's go. Dark Pulse. Yeah, buddy. Dark Pulse nearly does it, and... Wow, look at that. She's coming out with a lovely kiss right here. Good gravy. And, of course, we're falling asleep right here, so make sure to prepare yourself thoroughly right here, guys. Make sure to buy some healing items, and, uh, well, let's see. I think I have an awakening right here, yeah. Don't necessarily want to use the full heals just yet, so here we go. We awakened ourselves, and here comes a blizzard attack. Mm oh, wow! <laughs> okay, I see what you're doing, Lorelei. I see what you're doing, and I like it. I don't know why, but it just turns me on right here. So here we go, another f full heal. And we're not just going to have three. We're going to have plenty of it. And here comes another blizzard attack. And seriously? <laughs> Mew de Uno? Yes, Fiery Determination has thawed out. So you are screwed. Let's go Dark Pulse. Yeah, buddy. Okay. Jinx has been defeated. <laughs> okay, alrighty. She's about to come out with a cloister. I got the Pokemon for the job. Let's go straight back to Sparky. Oh, damn. Look at this. Look at this. Look at that. Okay, look at this guy. And here she's coming out with a cloister. Again, I am just looking at her. Look at her. She's just wiggling left and right. She's looking lovely as hell. But here comes a thunder attack. Super powerful. Eat it! Oh, yes. Yeah, this cloister has nothing. Nothing at all. <laughs> oh, yes. More experience points for all of us, and Lorelei is about to come out with a Lapras, so I'm going to stay put right here, because Lapras is the most powerful Pokemon. And, well, let's go right ahead and finish it off. Thunder. And, wow, she avoided the whole hit. Gravy. Alrighty, let's try it again. Thunder, it was gonna happen. We were gonna miss at some point. Here we go. Thunder attack for the win. Oh, nearly gets defeated. 
Okay, here comes a Hydro Pump, and we're just taking all these hits from this, uh, this Pokemon, and good gravy. Alright, we're wet. Here we go. Double Kick. There we go. And that does it. Say goodbye to Nessie. Okay, alrighty, look at that. And more experience points, and look at that. Sparky grows to level 69. Alrighty, okay. And here she comes out with a slow bro. No problem. Just use your good old buddy Sparky right here. And yes, what a better move to use than Thunder right here. Say goodbye, Alolan Slowbro. <laughs> I'm just playing. Look at that. No more Slowbro. And well, Slowbro has been defeated. Our mmm mmm. Our lovely Lorelai has been defeated. She looks surprised. Things shouldn't be this way. Well, guess what? It happened. It kind of did. So, look at that. Looks like you've gotten stronger since we last met. Go on ahead. You only got a taste of the Pokemon League's power. Whatever you say, baby. Whatever you say. I'm just going to look at you for a little bit. I'm just going to look at you. Anywho, let's move on right here. And, well, let's see. The next trainer right here is Bruno. This guy looks like an MMA fighter. MMA fighter, I should say. Now... Originally, I had a plan to switch out Pokemon left and right, just, uh, you know, with my original team and my regular team right here. And, well, I kind of figured that I should just stay put right here. We need to beat the Elite Four with what I got. Eventually, I'll use, I'll use whatever Pokemon I have in my disposal just to beat the Elite Four. And, well, we're just going to be healing up our Pokemon right here. Look at that. Okay, and, okay, so, if I'm not mistaken... Homeboy here likes to use some Rock-type Pokemon, so let's go ahead and switch it out. Actually, let's switch it out to Mew de Uno, because we do have a little bit of a move that can beat both typings right here, so what's up? I am Bruno of the Elite Four. Through regular training, people and Pokemon become stronger without limit. I have lived and trained with my fighting Pokemon, and that will never change. Draven, was it? We will grind you down with our superior power. Oh, crap. Holy crap. This guy is, uh... <laughs> Holy crap. Alright, so here we go. Elite, fab Elite 4 battle number 2 against Bruno. And yes, I was right. He is coming out with his Onyx. Alright, Mewduino. Let's get it. You're looking like a, a big old pimp right here. We got the move for you. Let's go Mega Drain. And look at that. Mega Drain drains him of all his energy. Say goodbye to Onyx. Okay, so we're really prepared for this guy right here. I always thought that Bruno was like the weakest of the, the Elite Four just because, you know, it's fighting type Pokemon. You can defeat him. And here he comes with his strongest. So let's go Psychic Attack right here. He's not going to touch us. He will not touch us. Look at that. Machamp. Defeated. Oh, yes. Okay, alrighty. Look at that. And, well, let's see. Coming out with a Polyrath. Okay. That's a, that's a dirty tactic right there. Alrighty, so Polyrath, you're looking like a big old beefy Pokemon right here. But guess what? You're going to take a Psychic Attack. That's right. And it survived. Holy crud. Well... I thought we were going to be going on touch, but I, <laughs> I guess we are going to get touched right here. So, let's go ahead and use a Mega Drain. Yeah, buddy, look at this. Mega Drain for the win. And we get some HP while we're at it. Yeah, buddy. Okay, alrighty, say goodbye to Polyrath. Okay, look at this. And Sand Slash grows to level 66. That's good. And he's going to come out with his Hitmonlee. Okay, he's got two Hitmons. Might as well embarrass him while we're at it. So, let's go. Psychic Attack right here. And look at that. Psychic Attack does its trick. Defeats Hitmonlee. And he cannot stand up. Oh, my God. Mm -mm -mm. All right, so he's coming out with a Hitmonchan. So, let's continue on right here with Mew de Uno. And Mew de Uno is probably going to have his way with two two of the Elite Four members right here. It's probably unfair just me using it right here. And look at that. No more Hitmonchan. 
that is it, guys. See, this is the reason why we're doing a full-on episode of the Elite Four, because things like that happen. If you have defeated me, then my job is done. Ugh. I may not lock it, but go. Go face your next challenge. That's right. I defeated you. Okay, so we got to do something right here. We have to heal up our Pokemon again. And maybe, just maybe, use an Aether. On, I'll actually just use it on this guy right here. And let's see, an Elixir. This medicine could be used each of its moves. Okay, let's just give that to Muta Uno since I've used it the most. Let's move on. What's up? Who's next? Ooh, hello, Agatha. Looking creepy. It's appropriate because it's Halloween. Oh, it's about to be Halloween, so... Yeah, I'm not changing Pokemon on my team. Let's go. I'm Agatha of the Elite Four. I hear Oak's taking a lot of interest in you, child. That old Duff was once tough and handsome, but that was decades ago. He's a shadow of his formal, former self. Now he just wants to fiddle with his Pokedex. He's a fool. Pokemon are for battling. Draven, I'll show you how real trainer gets, or trainer battle gets. Oh, damn! He's trying to put some voodoo on me. Okay. So here we go. Oh, damn. I do love the graphics on the Elite Four. Take it on Agatha of the Elite Four. I don't know how this Pokemon is a ghost type. They should probably call her the poison type trainer because they're all poison types. So let's go. Yep. Psychic attack. Yeah, buddy. What now, Arbok? What now? Yeah, you got nothing on me. Nothing. Okay, so party's growing. And she's coming out with a Gengar. Let's continue on right here with Mew De Uno. Alright. What's up, Gengar? You're looking pretty smiley right there, but guess what? I got a Psychic Attack, Dark Pulse. Take your pick. I'll beat you with both. Look at this. Psychic Attack. Say goodbye to Gengar. Yeah, it is totally unfair for me using Mew right here. Okay, I swear it gets better, guys. Okay, so she's coming out with a gold bag. Guess what? I'm switching Pokemon, guys. Let's go Sparky. Actually, scratch that. Let's go Sand Slash. Yeah, buddy. Okay, we're giving everybody a fair share of the of the battle. We all know that Mew could defeat everybody in this uh, in this Pokemon League by itself, by mainly. And look at this. Here we have Golbat, and guess what? I taught Sand Slash a new move. Guess what? That's right, Rock Slide. Okay, and here comes a Crunch Attack. Oh, finally, somebody hit me. And our special defense, or our defense has gone down. So let's finish this guy off. Ice Punch for the win. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Say goodbye to Golbat. Okay, alrighty. And he, she's coming out with a wheezing. Gee, I wonder what Pokemon I can use. Yep, Mew to Uno. So she had... The, well, they, they, they made the effort to actually switch up her one of her Gengars and all that stuff, which is great. I'm actually happy about it. And here she comes out with wheezing. Look at this guy. Mm -mm, looking all mean and everything. But guess what? I got a Psychic Attack. He'll do the trick. And yes, say goodbye to Weezing. That is it, baby. <laughs> Muta Uno, still a pimp, and Dragonite grows to level 66. And she's about to send a Gengar. Let's go ahead and use a new Pokemon right here. Let's go with Leonardo. That's right. I'm going to use this Pokemon right here. And guess what? We're going to be doing some Mega Evolution. So what's up? Let's go. Come on, Gengar. Okay, alrighty. Let's do this. God power, activate. Using Surf Attack. Alrighty, let's go. With the Mega Evolution right here. And there it is, guys. Blastoise has evolved into Mega Blastoise, but still slower than this guy. So here we go. Surf Attack. Surfing on his waves right here. The power of Hawaii may hit you. Look at that. What now? And there we go. We have defeated Agatha. And yes, we are something special. We're getting a lot of money out of this. You win. I see what an old dove sees in you now. I have nothing else to say. Run along now, child. 
Okay, alrighty. So much for evil granny right there, and, uh, well, let's see, uh... Well, it's always nice to heal up your Pokemon right here. Yes, I do have a lot of super potions. Don't really care. Don't really want to waste a lot of my uh, regular potions and all that stuff. Okay, so if I had a nice feeling about what the next trainer might have, because I played this game quite a few times, or an iteration of its game, it might have. It might start with two flying type Pokemon. So let's go right ahead and take on this guy right here, Batman. I'm just. I'm playing. It's it's Lance. It's just Lance. He he has Super Saiyan God hair, but he he's not a Super Saiyan God. Let's go right ahead and take on this guy. Hmm. So you're Draven. I lead the Elite Four. You can call me Lance, the Dragon Trainer. You likely know the dragons are a Pokemon spoken of in legends. They are hard to catch and raise, but their powers are superior. I bet you anything I got mine in a trade. <laughs> Virtually indestructible, there's no being clever than with them. That's right. Well, are you ready to lose? Your Pokemon League challenge ends with me, Draven. Okay. Alrighty. So Homeboy thinks that we're gonna lose. I laugh at that. Here he is, guys. Lance, the Dragon-type trainer, and he, of course, is coming out with some Water-type Pokemon that think that are dragons. Alrighty. Maximum effort. Let's do this. That's right, I got thunder. Thunder for days. Look at this. Thunder for days. Oh, yes. Eat it. Say goodbye to Cedra. Yeah, that's right. That's right. You couldn't... You didn't expect that. You did not expect that. And let's see. Here he comes out with an Aerodactyl. Let's go ahead and switch our Pokemon right here. We do have a very, very specific Pokemon for this guy. Let's go back to Leonardo right here. He does have Surf. Aerodactyl is a faster Pokemon, but it's still a Rock-type Pokemon, so don't worry. I gotcha. Let's go, Aerodactyl. Bring it. Okay, let's see. Surf Attack. Surf Turf. Rock Slide. Yeah, it doesn't really do much. Okay, here we go. Surf and Turf Attack. And there we go. Aerodactyl has been defeated. Yeah, buddy. Okay, alrighty. So that's more points for all of us. And he's coming out with a Gyarados. Okay. I gotcha. We're going back to Sparky because uh, we got the move for this guy. Gyarados usually is the first Pokemon he comes out with. But, again, they switched up his team just for this occasion right here. Alrighty, Gyarados. What's up? How you doing? Say goodbye. Thunder Attack. Oh, yes. Look at this. Thunder attack. A go. <laughs> oh, yes. Gyarados defeated. Look at that. This Pokemon had no chance with us. And, well, he's about to come out with a Charizard. Well, it's time. Let's go Dragonite right here. And, yes, we do have a very specific move for this guy. Okay. See? See, Lance? I got myself a dragon type Pokemon. Let's go. He's got himself a wannabe dragon type. And we got the move for you. Let's go, Thunderbolt. Yeah, buddy. And here we go. What's up, Dragon Pulse? Oh, damn. Takes a nice hit right there. So, guess what? We got another move right here for you Thunderbolt for the win. Look at that. Look at that. Say goodbye to Charizard. Yeah, buddy. Okay. Alrighty. Boosted some points. Everybody's getting levels. Mew grows to level 65. And he's about to send out his own uh, Dragonite. So, let's go with Sand Slash right here. Now, I do, like, I, I do remember that Mew does have a Fairy-type attack, but I've always wanted to do this. Be a uh, Dragonite with a Sand Slash. Much less a an Alolan Slant Slash, and well, I got the moves for this guy since he does have some pretty darn good uh, physical attack. Look at that, Ice Punch for the win! Oh yes. Now, did we overtrain for this? Maybe. I hate to admit it, but you are a first-class Pokemon trainer. Well, why couldn't you call me the champ? Seriously, I still can't believe my my dragons lost to you, Draven. You are now the Pokemon League champion. Dot, 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 dot. 
Or you would have been, but you have one more challenge left. There is one more trainer to face. That trainer is... Oh, Professor Oak? Really? Hello there, Draven. Congratulations on your victory over Lance. Hmm. What's with that look of surprise? <laughs> your timing is perfect, Professor. Draven, you will... you, The one uh, you will face is... Professor Oak! Not really. <laughs> okay, that's funny. It's Trace. He beat the Elite Four before you. He is the Pokemon League champion. That's right. In the past, trainers who defeated uh, the Elite Four were only recorded as champions. This time, however, we'll officially be establishing the champions as part of uh, Pokemon League. Professor Oak is here to officiate the crowning of a new champion. It seems only fitting that it should be either you or Trace. You're the you're the or you're the two who took care of Team Rocket after all. Now then, head on or head onward to the stage of your final battle. Okay, well, let's see. Well, it was always down to this, and I, I definitely like the the joke with Professor Oak and all that stuff. And well, let's go ahead and use an Ether onto Sparky since it only it only used basically like one move. And, well, let's go ahead and use this right here. Look at that. Finish off the waters. There we go. Everybody's healed. Do not know why I bought so many healing items if, you know, I was going to be coming in this untouched and stuff. And, well, let's see. Let's see. Let's go right ahead and switch out our... Eh, you know what? Screw it. Screw it. We're going to do it. Because, uh, I mentioned this before. Uh, Trace does one of the stupidest things in Pokemon League history. Let's go right ahead and just uh, get it over with. Not cockiness, guys. It's just confidence. Alrighty. Walking to... Hey, w w what you doing in my stage, homeboy? Oh, look at that. <laughs> okay. So you got some moves right there. You did it, Draven! Oh man, that was great. I've been waiting. I beat the Elite Four and became the champion. You probably heard from the Professor, right? From now on, the champion will be a part of the Pokemon League and battle all kinds of trainers. I'm really glad my first, my first opponent turned out to be you, Draven. You're the one trainer I want to test my best against, after all. Let's battle, Draven. The champion seat is on the line. <laughs> Okay. Alrighty. Not flinching. I am not flinching. You're not that intimidating. Okay, guys. So here it is. We are taking on uh, the so-called champion Trace, and he has a full team. And, of course, he's coming out with Pidgeot. Just take a look at what he does, okay? I'm yawning. I am yawning at this guy, okay? Here we go. Um, pressing Thunder, and this guy Mega Evolves his freaking Pidgeot right off the bat. Look at how majestic that Pokemon is. But unfortunately, he won't be able to use it for very long because guess what? Look at this. Eat it. Fried chicken for dinner. <laughs> Woo! Look at that. Hey, Trace, so you remember that time you used a Mega Pidgeot? Yeah. Not so good. Okay, so enough the chit chat, and let's go ahead and just mop the floor with this guy. Okay, so he's coming out with a vile plume. I'm coming with uh, Sand Slash right here. Oh man, that was hilarious. Oh, I wish I could do that again. You know what? I'm gonna watch this episode after I'm done. It's worth it. And here he comes with the vile plume. Oh my god, I cannot believe he he mega evolved his freaking Pidgeot. Oh my god. And here it comes with the Reflect, okay. Okay, Trace, you want to boost up your defenses. Oh, man. Alright, screw it. Let's go, X-Scissors. And, of course, he's going to be using a full Restore, so... Yeah, good, good, good move, good move. Here we go. Look at that. It takes a huge chunk out of him. And, well, let's go right ahead and use an Ice Punch just to finish this guy off right here. Look at that. For the win... Eat it, Vile Plume. So that's two turns down. Three more to go for this Reflect attack. And look at that. Sand Slash grows to level 67. 
That's great. And, well, let's see. He's about to come out with a Rapidash. Gee, I wonder what kind of Pokemon I want to use. Let's go with Smasher. I haven't used this guy ever in this whole challenge. Might as well use him right here. Come on. Let's do this. All right, Rapidash. You're looking uh, all majestic and all that stuff, but guess what? I'm sorry to do this to you, but I got to drill run you. And here comes a Flare Blitz. Damn. Really got me, but guess what? The drill run does the trick. <laughs> oh, man. This is hilarious. So, he's coming out with a slow bro. Okay. I got the Pokemon for that guy. Hey, Trace, you remember that Mew that I caught? Oh, yeah. He's coming out with another, uh, another Mew. Let's go. Alright, Mew. Let's do this. Okay, slow bro. Just just sit down. Here we go. Mega Drain. Yeah, buddy. Takes half his HP. And look at that. He's gonna be using waterfall or surf attack right here. Yeah, it doesn't really do much damage to me. So I'm gonna use another uh I'm gonna try and use another Mega Drain just for, you know, healing purposes and all that stuff. I was gonna say tax purposes. Which by the way, I kinda did that last week, so <laughs> Nice. Look at that. Slowbro defeated. And, well, he's got two more Pokemon, and he's coming out with a Jolteon. Oh, wow. Who haven't I used? Let's go Dragonite right here. Yeah, buddy. Oh, I'm just looking at Trace right now. I was like, dude, I got a counter for every single one of your Pokemon right here. I memorized everything, and Jolteon ain't going to do nothing. So here we go. Outrage. And yes, I yeah, I moved out of the way. So here we go. Outrage attack for the win. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Dragonite kicking ass, taking names. Leonardo growing to level 65, and it wants to learn Hydro Pump. Well, you only live once. Let's go ahead and just switch it. Let's switch it for, uh, for Surf for just the time being right here. And, yes, I got a Pokemon right here. I know it might be the same freaking whatever, but let's go right ahead and use our good old buddy, Leonardo, just to finish this whole thing off. Yeah, buddy, look at this guy. And here comes Marowak. Alrighty. Hey, Trace, this is how you do it. Let's go. Hydro Pump. Yeah, buddy, look at this. Digivolution activated. And he's going to use all three of his cannons just to destroy you. Look at this. Hydro Pump for the win. Eat it. I mean, drink it. <laughs> Woo! That is how you do it, guys. That is how you counter every single one of his Pokemon. And look at that. Smasher grows to level 65. And Trace is like, okay, I admit it. Draven, you are the strongest Pokemon trainer in the world. That's right, buddy. Don't you ever forget that. Whew. Okay, so he's he's smiling because he lost and he's crying just a little. Oh, man. My reign is already over already? That was pretty short. You're the champion now, Draven. And as for me, I've got a new goal uh, to work for. Toward, I should say. Draven. All right, what's up, buddy? What you doing? So you've done it at last! You've defeated the Pokemon League. My sincerest congratulations. You've grown a great deal since you first caught Pikachu and set out with that Pokedex. Yes, Draven, you all you really came into your own as a fine young man. That's right. Uh, and Trace, you showed great resolve, never losing heart as you saw your journey through in the uh, through the end. I did see, though, in in the way that you did uh, battle. That kind of heart of yours might still be causing you to hold yourself back when it comes to your Pokemon and to facing Draven. It's hardly much of a weakness, but it may have cost you the battle this time. Professor Oak, seriously. I would have beaten him if he had a level 100 Pokemon. I seriously would have done it. Regardless, the two of you showed us in an extraordinary battle. Thanks, Professor. Draven. You understand that your victory was not just your own doing, don't you? 
it was the marvelous bond you share with your Pokemon and your, and that brought you here. Now, Draven, come with me. That's right. That's right. You, you've never been an asshole to me, Trey, so I'm not going to flip you off. Okay, so we're saving our adventure, and look at this, guys. <clears throat> Congratulations, Draven. This is where we record the Pokemon who have performed so admirably for their trainers here at the Pokemon League. This is the Hall of Fame. Being honored here is one of the greatest joys in a Pokemon trainer a Pokemon trainer may achieve. Draven, you battled hard to become a Pokemon League champion. Let us record the great achievement you and your Pokemon for all to remember. Alrighty. Oh cool. Alrighty. Okay. So that right there is uh is awesome. It is great gravy. So here it is guys, my Pokemon League Championship Victory Lap. And here is my team, good old Sparky. Look at that. Smasher, what's up? You're finally in the Pokemon League Championship and or League Champion in Sandslash. Look at that. Leonardo DiCaprio right here. And Dragonite, the good old Pokemon, and the one and only Mew de Uno. Although it was kind of unfair. <laughs> Look at that. Victory lap. Victory lap, guys. I'm throwing in that victory lap. Flipping it off everybody who's hated this video right here. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Look at that. Victory lap. You know, I did that once in college. It's pretty freaking awesome. Well, pressing A. Okay, alrighty. So, there it is, guys. That is the end of the very first, uh, well, the main adventure right here in Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. Oh, man, that was uh, quite an adventure right there, but you know what? It was fun. It was very, very fun. Now, this isn't the end of Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. There are quite a few things that we still need to do, kind of like capturing Mewtwo. Uh, battling a, a few trainers that, you know, we've known in the past, and a new one. And, uh, well, explaining what a, uh, explaining what, uh, a new challenge out there and all that stuff. But, yeah, there's not a lot of things to do except for just those things and stuff. Now, just because I did Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu, uh, Let's Go Pikachu, my buddy with Pokemon Adventures HD has let me know that, hey, he's going to be doing Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. So do uh, be aware to catch that. I know that, you know, he's sporadic with his uploading and all that stuff. But he's going to be uploading pretty soon here with Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. That way I can add that to uh, to my, uh, to my uh, whatchamacallit, my, my page right here. So, yeah, that's one thing right there. The other thing, too, is that we have completed the main adventure for Pokemon X. And I am very, very proud of it because it went very very well for all of you guys uh, like I said I am taking a small break from Pokemon X just so I can you know somewhat recharge record some extra more episodes for Pokemon Auras X uh, now let's go Pikachu and heart gold and later on this later on I will be posting up a poll of which starter Pokemon should you guys should I start with in Pokemon Sun and Moon depending on what version you guys want me to actually comment down below right here what game do you want Pokemon Sun or Pokemon Moon don't worry guys I have both thanks to our good old buddy who sold this uh, who sold the, 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 the capture card to me again let's see I'm gonna try and find him right now before this whole this whole thing ends right here I kind of want to give him a, a proper shout out right here since I found his channel and all that stuff let's see where are you buddy where are you where are you? Where are you? I've rec ah, there it is. Okay, so a huge, huge shout out and say thank you to this guy too, guys. Make sure to check out his channel. But a huge shout out goes to TMG Mario Gamer. Thank you, buddy, for sending me the uh, the capture card, selling it to me at a proper price. And uh, don't worry, guys. I will be taking care of that uh, capture card. I will be doing a lot. And on top of that. Thank you for all the Pokemon games that are in that, such as, you know, Pokemon Sun, Moon, Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon, Liquid Crystal, and all that stuff. Trust me, you help me a lot, especially right here for my channel. So, again, guys, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for, you know, liking my videos and all that stuff. 
including you, Mr. Disliker of every video. Thank you for watching my videos too. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode of Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu Walkthrough. See you guys. Hey, <laughs>